Good things come to those who wait. I knew you would come. It must be fate. Do I? It's just I've come to some important decisions about a lot of things. In any case, there is something that I'd like to talk to you about. I've already picked out the place. Well, will you come with me? Can't say for now. You'll understand when you come with me. Wonderful. Let us be on our way then. Say, mind if I tell you a bit about my past while we walk? <laughs> Years ago, I worked as a day laborer at Edo Castle. While there, I happened into the employ of a generous noble man. Those days are long gone, but I really had it good. Huh. You know, it so happens that it was snowing on that day also. We are almost there. You'll know it when you see. Right. Let's stop here, shall we? I believe you are already quite familiar with this spot. Indeed. This is the place where Lord E was attacked. By you, no less. I don't make mistakes. It's my business to know things after all. Like... How there was a veiled edge amongst the men who attacked Lord Yi at the Sakurada Gate. And that it was a veiled edge who murdered him. You see, all this time I've been watching you, testing your strength. And my suspicions have been confirmed. You are that veiled edge. So I ask you, who was it? that murdered my lord. What? Your blade twin? Then you must tell me the rogue's whereabouts this instant. Let's go, Veilbeck! The enemy of Lord <laughs> <Mordor> E! <laughs> You should be strong, but I won't go down so easily. What's wrong, Velvage? Why won't you finish the job? <sighs> Wonderful. Not that it matters, seeing as I've lost. But let me ask you one thing. What are your true feelings about Lord E? Tell me. Did his death accomplish anything? Really? You believe my lord accomplished that? So, his death was not in vain. Thank you. I promise to not speak a word of what has happened here today. 
The public will be better for it. As will you, I imagine. <laughs> Naturally, I will make no mention of it in my writing, either. Manabe. Ah, we served the same lord, but that is all. If you ask me, the man is stuck in the past. We are not at all alike. Good question. With Lord Oi gone, I have no further ties to the Shogunate. Who knows? I may open up a used bookstore and then continue peddling information on the side. But I do hope we will meet again someday, if the fates allow. We meet again. I see now it was wrong, what I did to the Shogun. Forgive me. So the Demon Claw Samurai is your so-called Blade Twin. I once schemed with that villain to plunge this country into civil war. After the dust had settled, I imagined that the British would take over, that I'd be put in charge and that Japan would be mine. I really believed that I'd be able to protect its beautiful culture from the great powers. But I was blind. That villain would have had Japan destroyed in a bloody war. And had that happened, all would be lost. That is why I promise to do everything in my power to protect this country from now on. Do you trust me? Thank you. You know, this is the first time we've really spoken to each other since our first meeting. Ah, that old poem. You have a good memory. Had Edo been consumed by flames, there would have been no such picturesque deaths. I didn't expect to find you here. So you're a friend of Mr. Sato? I have business with him too, and of a rather urgent nature. I hope you don't mind my interrupting. Mr. Sato, I recall you're having some connection to the Sekihotai. Well, they appear to be up to no good. Any ideas as to what they're planning? One thing does come to mind. The Demon Claw Samurai mentioned something about using them to blow up Kaneji Temple. Kaneji is the family temple of the Tokugawa, you see. 
So if you ask me, those nasty retainers are likely planning to storm Edo. You must understand, Kaneji Temple is a national treasure. What do you say? Will you help me prevent its destruction at the hands of the Sekihotai? I shan't forget this. Now, if they have indeed begun to mobilize, we'd best make haste. Every second counts. I am heartened to know we can count on you. Let us meet at Kaneji Temple, then. You came! As expected, the temple grounds are crawling with suspicious individuals. I fear we may be too late. Indeed. Say, I may have an idea as to where they might plant their bombs. Given that the Sekihotai are seeking to provoke the Shogunate, they will surely plant any bombs in places of symbolic import. Let us go. Let's be quick. He who hesitates is lost, after all. No! This temple was one of Japan's treasures!
Well, time. Ah, I had forgotten one place. Tosoku Shrine. 
It's the most important shrine in Weno. Let's hurry! People should interfere. It seems that our work here is done. Toshogu Shrine is safe and sound thanks to your courageous efforts. We may not have saved all of Kaneji Temple, but I expected as much. Tell me, Mr. Sato, that Yukawa fellow said this was all your plan. And indeed it was. For I was once blinded by my excessive love for this country. Indeed. The culture of Japan is a marvelous thing. To think that I came so close to destroying an invaluable piece of it. I wonder, do you think I can redeem myself? Doubtless you're correct. In other words, talk is cheap. It is time for action. However, my first order of business is to safeguard against a possible retaliation. I should be safe at the manor in Takanawa. You know, I have many valuable belongings there. Paintings and scrolls and other curios I've collected from all over Japan. In fact, you should really come by sometime for tea. I'm quite the connoisseur. Well, until then...
Are you here to see Mr. Sato? I'm afraid tea time will have to come later. My efforts to track the Sekihotai's movement have led me straight here. They've broken into the manor in retaliation for our actions. Mr. Sato appears to have anticipated this and has prepared himself for the siege. I must rescue him before it is too late. Will you help me? Thanks. Okay. But it would be reckless to try to enter through the front gate. The place is crawling with enemies. However, I believe there to be a secret entrance in the back. We'd best sneak in that way. Taking them so long inside. Open up already. You got them. There will be a hidden passage. You got them. Nada. 
a dead end. Damn this house. You got them. You got them.
for something? I'm glad you're here. But did you have to bring the enemy with you? Found you, Sato! You'll pay for better angers! I prefer to think of it as realizing what's important. What luck that I can attend to my brother, too. I will kill you both! Yeah. My brother was a man to be the Japan to a better future! Yeah. My brother yeah. was yeah. like this! Yeah. Yeah. Give me, brother! I have retreated. Thanks to you, of course. As you can imagine, this is not what I had in mind when I invited you over earlier. 
Those assassins appear to be acting on the Demon Claw Samurai's orders. It seems my betrayal has been quite the bitter pill to swallow. Even so, my resolve remains firm. No matter how many times they strike at me, I refuse to give in. Although the cruelty of that villain is not to be underestimated. You're not easily intimidated, are you? Well then, I shall take you at your word. As for myself, I have no intention of giving up. I must continue to pour everything into preventing further violence. As an interpreter, I have many contacts, you see. And though I cannot fight like you, I am confident that I will have a role to play. So, let us work together to protect Edo. Nay, all of Japan. I must say, you two have become very friendly while I've been away dealing with the remnants of the Kurosu. Yes, you could say that. Well, since we're all here, anyone up for tea time? Getting pretty heated. Oh, 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 oh,
Tuga. Hey, that's a nice blade you got there. Any interest in working as a bodyguard? The shops around here have lately been the target of so-called expulsionists. Refuse to pay them a fee, and they'll mess up your place good. I'm starting to get worried about my own shop, so... What do you say? Would you help me guard my store? Rumor has it, the revolutionist army is poised to attack Edo. So, I imagine they are too busy preparing for war and stuff like that. Of course I want the Shogun to stay strong and all. But I suppose we'll have to defend our shops all by ourselves. Oh, thank you. If you could start right away, that would be great. Though, the ruffians probably won't be here till night. I'm enjoying my retirement. And occasionally, I'll slaughter some scum in my free time. You don't mind that, do you? Perhaps I'll tell you the whole story someday. But while you're here, there's something I wanted to say to you. It's about your decision to not take Lord E's life. Thank you for that. After being thrust from public life, he was cut down by an assassin. Still, I'm sure he remained strong till the end. Well, now that I've thanked you, tell me, what are you doing here in Edo? I see. So you want to be of use to the country my lord worked to protect. How about I lend you a hand? As much as it pains me. Is that sarcasm? Huh. Perhaps we are not so different after all. But I must look for a suitable place to stay. Come look for me if ever you need. Goodbye for now. Is it over? Please, I'd like to talk with you. You are amazing! 
Clearly, your blade isn't just for show. Thanks to you, I can continue my business in peace. What difference would it make? I've heard that some clan is actively trying to get Ronins to rebel. But we townsfolk couldn't care less who's pulling the strings. So long as they let us live in peace. You take care of yourself too. I really can't thank you enough. <laughs>